In this video, we are going to look at uh, a question from chemistry. So question uh, A, we we'll have defined the term concentration. So this is the number of moles of solutes per cubic decimeters. over the solution so here the solute C will be sodium hydroxide since it dissolves in water then our order is a solvent so whenever we mix a solute with a solvent we form what we call a solution so a solution may have a lower or more concentrated solution so we need to find the concentration so the formula for concentration is C is equal to N where n represents number of moles, then v the volume in decimeter cubed. Now, if you look at the data that we have, we have mass in grams, so we are going to use 60 grams to find the number of moles for sodium hydroxide. So the number of moles, whenever mass is given, is given by this formula, n is equal to mass divided by molar mass. Then we need to find the molar mass, so we'll first begin by finding mister. So the chemical formula for sodium hydroxide is this one. So we need to find how many atoms of sodium are there in sodium hydroxide. So there is only one, so sodium multiplied by one. Then oxygen times, there is one here, plus hydrogen times, there is also one here. The mass number for sodium we use 23 times 1 plus 16 multiplied by 1 plus 1 times 1. Then 23 times 1 is 23 plus 16 plus 1, giving us the total of 40. Therefore, molar mass is equal to 40 grams per mole. So whenever you add grams per mole to relative formula mass, then you get the molar mass. So we can now say number of moles is equal to the mass is 60 grams over 40 grams per mole. So the grams cancel. 60 divided by 40 will give us 1.5 moles. So this is what we are going to substitute on N. So we now substitute. So at this N we put 1.5 moles. Then the volume is 300 cubic centimeters, but we need to convert that one into decimeter cubed. So we'll say 1 decimeter cubed is equal to 1000 centimeters cubed. To convert from decimeter cubed into centimeter cubed, multiply by 1000. Then the reverse, you divide by 1000 whenever you are converting from centimeters to decimeter. So this 300 cubic centimeter, we divide by 1,000, you get 0 0.3 decimeter cubed, which is our final answer. 1.5 divided by 0 0.3. So I'm getting 5 as my final answer. So the concentration is 5 moles per decimeter cubed. Or if we want, we can find the whole thing at once. So we can say concentration is equal to number of moles. Then this I will just write as divided by volume. Then where there is N, we can substitute with this one, giving us a mass over molar mass. Then over 1, we change this to multiplication, giving us 1 over V. Then concentration is equal to mass over molar mass times z volume so if we put the mass is 60 grams divided by the molar mass is 40 then the volume is 0 0.3 so if we do the math 60 divided by 40 times 0 0.3 i'm still getting the same answer fives so five moles per decimeter cubed so that's it. Thank you so much.